come here. Where is your wife? She's in Nigeria. Hmm? Right. Mm, there's problems. Exactly. You hear me? Yeah. And now you see you're leaving. No, <laughs> You know, you are, you, are, you are having a spirit of confusion. And now there's a problem there. This woman, she's suffering there. You hear me? Yes. You want to bring her here? Yes, just exactly. Mm? Yes, sir. But there's a problem. You hear me? Yes. This is a problem of documents also. Exactly. Huh? But this woman is suffering. You saw how I pointed this brother. He was outside of the church. So, you want me to pray for you? Sir? Can I pray for you? Exactly. To sort it. out this documents problem. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. But the, also you've got confusion. Can I tell you the confusion? Tell me. You don't know whether you should continue with this marriage. Yes, because we had a serious issue. I was like... That's what I'm telling you. You don't know whether to continue yeah. with this lady or maybe there, will, there must be another one. So that's another issue now. You hear me? Yes. Sir. So you are a Nigerian? Yes. Mm. Yeah. So come here and pray for you. Come and pray for you. God loves you. If you see a Nigerian coming to church, just know your church is right. You don't see Nigerians going to any church. Oh, because Nigerians, they pray. I'm telling you, most Nigerians, they pray. In Nigeria, everything is worse. When you become a witch, you are a most powerful one. When you become a Christian, you become the most powerful Christian. You know? Nigeria and Limpopo is the same thing. <laughs> same WhatsApp group. I'm telling you. You know, it's just we cannot do a match of witches of Natal and of Limpopo. You'll see something. Ah. You know, Nigeria and Limpopo is... In fact, check how Limpopo is, you know. You check the mountains, the way that they, it's similar to Nigeria. Witchcraft, Angel, Angel Vendange, ah, hey. ah. So Nigeria and us, us there, because well, I'm also from there, we are the same. Everything we overdo it. If you become a witch from Limpopo, don't play with witches from Limpopo. Eh? I want to show you something now. If you are from there and you have been wished, I command that demon to leave you now. Come on! Look. 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 You see? You see? Come on! You demon from Limpopo, come on! Get me a volume there, my voice is going down. Come out! If you, are, you have been wished and you are from Limpopo, I set you free today. In the name of Jesus! In the name of Jesus! In the name of Jesus! Huh? If you are from Limpopo, I tell that demon to come out. I say, hey, come out! I say, hey, come out! Come out! Uh, I know these demons. Huh? You are saying what? Mm. So now you believe me now. You believe me. Because I'm giving you a sign. I say, you demon from the come out! Yeah? You are insulting me now. Uh, uh, which one is that? <laughs> Listen to this demon. That one is too big for you. Uh, uh, but Jesus is bigger. Amen. I 
I don't care about myself. Me, I'm useless. But there's Jesus. Mm. You know, in Limpopo, let me tell you this. There's only one province where they say there's a mountain you can't go to. You know that? Yeah? But everywhere in South Africa, people are climbing mountains. But there's only one. They say when you climb, they don't come back. I'm sure you know that. Eh? How many of you know that? And we, you normally pass it when you're going home. Next, next week, I'm going to KZN. Amen. Next week, Redila Leva KZN. Amen. You hear me? I'm sure you demons of KZN, you are listening to me. Next week, I, we are dealing with KZN demons. When we move from KZN, we go to Mpumalanga. From Mpumalanga, you know, there's this province called Bloemfontein. Yeah, there's problems there. Next week, I want to call your province by its name. Any territorial demon there must leave the people of God. <laughs> 